It's uh, 625. See, it's funny, my alarm just went off. But uh, I've been up since like 419 because, uh, again, scooter board. It was weird. I was having a vivid dream and I woke up. I used to have a lot of vivid dreams. But anyway, as soon as I wake up again, you know, he starts pulling off. me. So I ain't been back to sleep. Just like I said. So I said, since I'm up anyway, I might as well get up and start making vi make a video about yesterday. Again, I knew the whole thing when I even saw this job. Uh, they wanted me to pick it. Again, you got a disgruntled, uh, it's a, a store opening, you know, it says store fixtures. And when it's in the morning, like 8 o'clock, 10 o'clock, whatever, that means the store ain't open. I already knew that means it's a brand new store because uh, they coming out in the morning. Dude, you ain't got to creep. You can close your door. But, uh, and you know, ain't nobody over here fucking around. Oh, they're, they're over there creeping and you can't, probably can't see them. But uh, they just came out. So anyway, the uh, yeah, you know everybody know around here's no better than to be creeping over here at night or in the morning. But uh, anyway, they said uh, uh, yeah, I already knew it's a brand new store. Plus, it ain't got a name, and it's just you know, you just got an address, you know, whatever the, the grid code. But, uh, yeah, you know, the Google took me there, took me right there. But that's another thing. It's boring as hell driving. It's an hour, but it ain't on a highway. It's only like 30 miles, so you got to go back roads, and you got to, you're only doing 45 going through lights. So it take, it seemed like it take forever. But an hour on the highway, you know, stuff that's like 50 miles away, you know, it don't, you seem like you're there in a couple of minutes, even though it's literally an hour. The same amount of time, but... And then at nighttime, coming back, you know, get off at five, so it's definitely traffic, but still only take an hour, but it's just... Anyway, the point is, what I was talking about, uh, the, but, the, the dude, the uh, old buddy, is uh, it's just two guys, they're, they're uh, tra contractors, and as usual... Oh, but also, yeah, like I said, you know, you this, this whole thing is trying to stop people from waking, making money, you know... You, like I said, uh, the Saturday he did it. Today he did it. He, you know, and I can't get back to sleep. But I ain't even tired because I go to bed early when I got to go to work. So it's just principle. Whatever, however they do it, or maybe they're fucking demons. You know, like I said, I was having a vivid dream or possessed. You know, he's in the league with him. Whatever, <laughs> you laugh and joke. I already know what time it is. I know there ain't nothing good. They lying. They, you know, they lie. It's just that's what I'm talking about uh, yesterday. So they're still mad. They're, they're, I think what they're really still mad about is the dude I cussed out, Mr. Good, Goody Two Shoes. You know the the adults. He's just like Kamala Harris. I love it. The Pelosi. You know they they get mad. You remember that's why they were talking about Trump the way he talked. But they they provoked him. And you're supposed to let them do what they do and, and, and lie on you and not defend yourself. And you're supposed to be nice in return. It's like letting somebody spit in your face and be nice or slap you. But they get scared when you get at their ass and play victim. You know what I'm saying? Just like they're doing right now. I'm going to do a video about that when I get off. Or maybe, I don't know. I ain't going to say all it, but it's going to be late by the time I get back here. But, uh, so anyway, you know, they're still mad about that, that because they keep bringing it up every job last week. Oh, yeah, these, you know, these guys... Sometimes they try to black because they know that because I say something. Because the point is, this this company got a lot of people who get into it with customers. You know, the the the, the people we go work for. Been like that. It ain't just me. They'll cuss them out in a heartbeat. You know, because they treat them like shit. Especially the ones who really don't got no money. They got to get dropped off, take the bus, take the train. You know, they're homeless, and. uh it's, they don't expect someone, you know, I pull up in a nice car, you know, especially when I had the Mustang, you know, I was pulling up and that Mustang was brand new, you know, better car than theirs, and they're mad, why is this car better than, you know, you're working for this company, you know, making $12 an hour, <laughs> don't worry about it, you know, so, but I know how you treat the other people, so I was, you know, I'm sticking up for my, the, the temps, but, uh, so, yeah, nasty gang stalkers. The rest of us, you wouldn't care. As long as they come to do the work, you're happy. You're happy as fuck. Oh, there's some, these guys, are, they, they, they're some good guys. They came through and got us out of there. 
these motherfuckers worried about your money. And so they, they'll, they, they'll definitely, because they need their money, you know, they got a whole bunch of stress. They might be just worried about getting high later on. It don't matter, but they, they came to work. They do the job. It's none of your business. <laughs> so the point is, the people in the office that we work, they'll just send you, they say, okay, they just don't go back. They'll just send them. They won't fire them. See, they're, they're right now though. They didn't change the, the, their little thing. They're trying. They're, they're on the. They're mad about the election last year. That you know, they, they, there's not no. They lost. They literally, you know, they got. They're not the majority no more. They're mad about all that. So. Just now, uh, but they really. That's how you know. This is. I don't know. It's like they're not human. Like they don't. It's like you don't remember. You don't remember me from two years ago, a year ago? You know damn well I'm not finna let you lie on me. And so now they're mad because they, I cursed that dude out because the, 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 the dude on the, uh, they were trying to hit me on purpose. They were trying, they were hoping, you know, this is, da- and it's gonna be, oh, this, it was a dangerous, too dangerous for you. You're not smart. This and that. And it's like, no, that, that shit, bitch, I've been, you know, over paratroopers. It's like, no, you're not finna hit me. They got mad because they even said it. Truck driver. I said, no, this dude gonna run into this wall right here. You know, and also one of those big yellow pylons out of steel. I'm standing right next. I'm like, you stupid. I'm like, I knew, I knew the whole time y'all, were, you know, like the the yard trucks, all that shit. Like, bitch, I'm watching you. I know y'all stupid. And legally, y'all are gonna get in trouble. You're supposed to be watching us. You know, all that. that no, they because the, 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 the forklift. If you see all that, you gonna get in trouble. Lose your job if you, if you hit somebody. Ain't no, oh, he would, he should have, that Democrat shit, he should have been white. No, you, you're the one up there on the forklift. We got the right of way. And like, they got mad. I said, no, this fool going to tear his truck up before he hit me. There's, there's no way he going to hit me. Ain't even before he hit me. He's he going to roll into a big old steel pylon that's, that's two, uh, half a foot thick round. Cemented into the ground. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's, it's, it's yellow. It's about this high, you know, whatever. It's about four feet high. He's going he gonna to tear his truck up and his fucking CDL. <laughs> Trying to be funny. And they, that's when they really got mad, you know. I, I wasn't supposed to say that. And so the little dummy, the other temp, that was saying, he, he on purpose. And it's so finally I slapped. I snapped. I said, nigga, what the fuck you doing? And he, he trying to be talk back. And so, yeah, and so they heard it, but then then the, the black dude come out with the white dude, the people that work there for Home Depot. Uh, what, what's going on? Is this a problem? I, I said, no, then he, you know, because they, they're part of the gang. Oh, so that, he's come to me. That means you haven't been. No, he's on the forklift. He's supposed to watch me. He ain't going to, you know, I turn around. Here he come. Oh, you supposed to have situational aware. No, bitch, situational aware is you supposed, you're on the forklift. You're supposed to watch for people. And they got mad, and so I cussed the black dude out. He, you know, he wanted them older, try to act like, oh, we don't do that around. I said, no, bitch, stay the fuck away from me, because they walking behind me. I said, Step, keep, keep from walking behind me, both of y'all. I'm leaving off your goddamn property. Don't walk behind me, motherfucker. He got mad. They all got mad. Their feelings hurt. Playing victim. Doing some dirty shit. And so that's what I'm saying. They've been trying to black blacklist me, even on other apps, but it don't work. Because one, I've been working for this company so long, they know me. And it ain't it. That's my point of bringing this up. Uh, let me make two videos right quick.